If you watched my review for Prey, I mentioned in that video that I'd be doing a reaction to a trailer for a movie I didn't want to say quite yet because I was excited for it and I hope that you guys would be too. That trailer dropped and it is Terrifier 2. If you didn't see the first Terrifier, you're already behind. So catch up and then watch this. Let me... I don't know which one it is. Shut up. Is it this? I guess. I guess this is it. 480p. Get the hell out of here. Let me show the volumes up. So, did you figure out what you're dressing up as, Kamara? He wants to dress up as a real guy who murdered nine people last year. Oh, you're not doing that. It's just a costume. <laughs> I think that guy's still out there. What's up with you and this clown all of a sudden? You're like obsessed. They never found his body. What if he decides to come back here? I wouldn't worry about it. Wait a minute. Aren't you that guy from the costume shop? Sir, what are you doing? Oh, that's creepy. It wasn't me. He was covered in blood on his shirt and his hands when he got here. I'm telling you it was him, Molly. Right down to the little black dot on the tip of his nose. <laughs> You're really weird, you know that? It's got the same exact aesthetic what? as the first one. Something really bad's gonna happen tonight. No, I, I know when Jonathan's lying, okay? I, I could hear it in his voice. Something's, something's wrong. Look, we're gonna have fun. Mm -hmm. Stress-free environment. Yep. Speaking of surprises, kids, we have a very special guest with us today. All the way from Miles County. Please welcome Art the Clown. Oh shit! Um, well, that certainly looks more violent than the first. Even though if you have not seen the first, there is a, uh, there is still a kill in the first one that you most likely won't forget. It involves a, um, a saw and a woman. That's all I'll say. This looks fantastic. This looks great. It's exactly what I thought it would be. And it still has the same tone and the aesthetic as the first one. The actor who plays Art the Clown does really well in these performances. It's almost like a, um, there's a theatrical element to it, like a whimsical, fantastical element. He seems to be having fun, like tiptoeing around and creeping like a kid, which I think just adds to the, um, to the overall terror and, and fear that he's trying to build. If it's in a theater by me, I pray to God I can get tickets to it. I'd love to see this on the big screen. But if not, it's gonna also stream on Screenbox if you have a subscription for that, which I don't think I do. But if it's not anywhere near me, then I guess I'll be getting a subscription just to watch this. But October 6th, mark your calendars. Thank you for watching my video. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.